Today we're going to make a little video to show um, you how to make a digital or online day plan book. So I'm just going to go into my day plans and open up my, my weekly plan. So here's what my schedule sort of looks like. I've got my Monday to Wednesday on one page and when I print it out because I still keep my paper copy, um, I've got the other stuff on the back. Off the page, so page two would be Thursday, Friday, and then sort of a to-do list. Um, so let's start with Monday. We've got reading. Um, so let's say I was going to work on um, a organizer, so my objective, uh, teach, text proof, and connections. And, you know, if you have a, a lesson plan, I'm going to open up my fake lesson plan here. What you can do is you can take your shared uh, link, and you can get that shareable link here. So we'll copy it, go back to my weekly plan. If I highlight any part here, let's highlight reading, and I click on my link button right here, and I cut and paste that in there. Now anyone who wants to look at my lesson plans or for myself, I can click on this here and it will take me to that fake lesson plan. As you can see, it opened up a second copy there. So that's one way. Now, if you want to um, keep track of you know, what the work tasks are doing, you might just type work task. And again, same thing. I'm going to use this ape response organizer here. I'm going to go to my share link so we can get that shareable link. Control C to copy. So I'm done. And I'm going to highlight work task. And I'm just going to Control V, put that link in. So now I've got my reading lesson plan. I've got my work task right here. So again, I can click on it. It'll open up that ape response organizer. And there is my language reading lesson plan done. So I've got that all within my day plan here and it's easy to access the lesson plan as well as the work task just by adding shareable links um, to certain keywords.